quarantine stuff. Hey guys, I just got done filming Mr. Moped. Uh, that was fun. It was actually, that actually wasn't even supposed to be a video. It was supposed to be today's video. I haven't even watched the stuff yet, so I hope it turned out good. Uh, it was exciting to make. I, like I said, I purchased some property here in Florida. I'm from New York. Uh, I haven't showed you guys the property itself. We're just gonna dive into the backyard today because we actually don't know uh, what exactly I'm going to do with the property because I wasn't here when I bought it, so I should have, or maybe I shouldn't have, because if I didn't, we wouldn't be making this awesome track we're about to make. But if I, yeah, so it, maybe it worked out. I'm pretty sure, I'm 90% sure that I've decided what I'm going to do with the property, and then once the steps are taken and we get the green flag, then we'll go ahead and start filming that and bring you guys right into the loop and give you guys the entertainment and the 3D machines that you want and love. But today, we're gonna, we're gonna go beyond this gate. Right here, back here, there's a, there's a track. And I think we can hook that track up to my fence. Let paradise really begin. You might be able to see my dirt bike back there, way back there, about 100 yards. So from the back of the fence, we've probably made it maybe 60 feet. This stuff is thick. Nobody's been back here for a while. But I got a trail going through here, and we're probably maybe a sixth, a seventh of the way there. Hopefully it opens up a little bit more. This stuff is tight. We need to get the moped back here. We need a nice trail. Oh, look at this guy. Whoa. That thing has to be poisonous. I'm trying to prop my camera up here. I went back to camp. Got another tool. Some water. Gotta stay hydrated down here. It's warm. For winter it's warm. I know that there's an opening because of the next door neighbors. They took me to the opening and I actually have it on a GPS map right here. Okay, just downloaded this app. Now we're gonna track where I am now, go to the track itself, and then track the track and see what's the most efficient way to get through here. I started at my gate, went around by the road, got into the opening and, and saw how far I could go before, you know, to try to get as close to my starting point as possible. So as you can see, I started there, went down the road, came in here, and I'm about halfway to that point. And the trail, it wants to go that way, but we gotta go that way. So maybe if I follow it, we still gotta go, what direction is that? Uh, I don't know, that way. <laughs> I literally almost lost you because this is my first time back here. <laughs> Sorry about that. Luck would have it that up on our left, there's a trail. We started there, the closest I got was about here. So we got a lot of trail to make. Uh, 
don't know if you guys ever have cut any trails in Florida, but these vines are like undoing a bunch of knots. You get one and then, it, then you get to another one. Uh, the mosquitoes haven't been too bad. I only got bit one so far, but I'm gonna have to have, I'm gonna have to check my body all over for ticks. I don't want a tick. I guess they, Lyme disease or something? Is that, I don't know, if somebody could educate me on insects down here and or anything that can kill me or hurt me, I'd appreciate it if you left that in the comment section. I made it to a clearing, however, I had to go back for water and your guys' battery was shot. So we made some pretty good progress. Cause I just went through the gate there and it's just going and going and going. Granted it's tight, but all it needs to do is fit a Motron. We're not, you know, making a trail for crush. Uh, yes, I still have crush. The reason why I moved to Florida, there are a couple different reasons. One being that I got sick of New York taxes. I uh, didn't feel like paying those anymore. So I wanted to go somewhere else that had cheaper taxes. I also wanted to go somewhere warmer, somewhere where I wasn't inside six months out of the year. Now granted I have heard, because it's, it's already hot right now, that people usually down here spend the six months in winter outside, but then the six months during summer they stay inside. So I think then I'll be scuba diving and trying to get into the waters as much as I can. Uh, originally, I wasn't going to film my house, my property, wasn't going to film that. But after the huge, huge issue, huge, uh, we're not going to call it an issue, an opportunity larger than I originally thought it was going to be, uh, since, since it's a larger opportunity and it's going to require more time, I think it'd be cool to document and a lot of you guys will, will, will enjoy it. We're about halfway, halfway there. This is where I had you guys set up for the time lapse. And I took off. There's my tools right there. Keep going through here. Um, I still have the Jeep. I still have my house up there. My sister actually lives in it right now. Yeah, cleared this all out. These vines are nuts. Super nuts. Um, I, I, this is going to be perfect. I was thinking of like uh, maybe a Moto Minute. You know, relaxing, enjoying um, after hours and hours working on this house, uh, coming out here and having like a moto minute uh, section of the video. You know, focus on something fun instead of work. I mean, work is fun, but you know, sometimes you need a break from anything. Check out the opening, you guys. We can see the sun. Look at this. This is where I got to. And I turned around to get you. And I think we're almost there. I'm not gonna pull out the GPS yet until I'm going to re require to cut some more stuff, but I think we got it. Where is it? See all this brown stuff means that, oh, hey, we got an owl, we got an owl. You guys check this out. I always hear him. Okay, I saw him earlier today too, a couple hours ago. Where did he go? We gotta find him. We have the coolest animals around here. Oh, he's sneaking behind the tree. That rascal. Oh, there's a second one. You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. We have owls in New York, but none at my house. <laughs> you guys take it the city. This, this area is cool. And also there's a lake right over here. And it's awesome. It's just we're in quarantine right now, so nobody's at the beach or anything. I haven't even experienced the beach yet. Thanks a lot, coronavirus. We are close. All we have to do is go that way, probably about 60 feet, and we're there. Let me find my stuff. We'll try to end this trail and get back to the track. And then you guys can check out the track.
sun's just about to go down. Made it to the trailhead. Let's take this sucker out. See how we did. giving us a direct pipeline to an awesome track and to endless fun opportunity with this thing, maybe some other future toys. Uh, I do apologize you guys for taking another three month break. Um, I, this house, this property, it's definitely not, and I, I do love this place, a dirt biker just went by, like an eight year old on a dirt bike, awesome. Um, we didn't have that at the last house. Uh, I do apologize for that. I want to get my ducks in a row so that I can make videos for you guys. I, I do apologize for not uploading. I, I'm doing my best so that I can get you guys some content. I'm happy that we got a trail now. We got a property down here. We're not freezing in New York. Can't wait to make some more videos. So stay froggy fresh, stay super fly. Until next time, 3D Machines and the Motron out. Enjoy your day.